So with that being said, I do want to bring up the elephant in the room, which is the Williams chassis. <laughs> the uh, if, And if we want to be specific, the other Williams chassis, the because other. this is Logan's chassis that is broken, has been confirmed to have to, had to be sent back to the UK. So it is probably at this point at Grove or just reaching Grove by now. Alex has a vendetta against this chassis. That yeah. is, that's what I'm determining. Um, that or he really hates James Bowles and he's like, I'm going to make your life really miserable. Poor yeah, so James. Is, oh my God, poor James, right? And Poor everyone at Williams, let's be honest, but yes. No, honestly though, poor Logan because yeah. what's going to happen to Logan? <laughs> um, so Logan had to give up his car. Alex took that car. Alex is now driving that car and Alex has now crashed that car. Um, Sergeant does have a repaired chassis in his car. Alex will maybe now have one, or does Logan have to sit out of China and Alex takes Logan's car? I think they said that it would be ready for China. Fortunately, like between Australia, Japan, we have two weeks between Japan and China, which is actually kind of interesting considering Japan and China are like neighbors. I mean, I know there's yeah. an ocean between them. So I, I thought it was really interesting that there is another two weeks between races. Um, but that said, they're still not going to have an extra you know, tub, bucket, chassis portion until Miami. But the wrinkle is that we're going to China the first sprint race of the year, which means an extra opportunity to crash or be crashed into or damage the car in some way. But here's the thing. And I know like, we're not even talking about Japan at this point, but who cares? Um, I do, but we'll get there. So if you're Williams, do you have confidence in Alex still like what happens if something happens in free practice one or the sprint shootout and Alex crashes again do you give him Logan's car or do you say Logan you haven't actually crashed we are gonna let you drive and not let Alex drive because Alex has crashed two you know races in a row yeah I mean he might be leading the destructors championship which if you have not seen on social media that is the estimated tabulations it. of uh how much damage each driver has caused their cars I think that if Alex crashes in the sprint they will not give the car or crashes it bad enough that it can't be repaired they will not give Logan's car at this point I, I think that Alex and obviously like we said no one was at fault for the Ricardo Albon crash but I don't think like at this point that they're going to be willing to face the really bad PR of being like Logan we got to give your car to Alex again if Logan was driving worse maybe but Logan actually has not been I mean he's on par with last year I shouldn't say he's driving amazing but at one point I was like oh Logan's driving well he he might finish P10 P11 he didn't um because he drove himself off of the track but into the dust you know I had never seen a car so dusty even my own car that I don't wash nearly often enough was less dusty than that Williams car and also this is like not the first time that he's had to reverse I think I DM'd you I was like he's really working the the reverse on this car because he I feel like every single race he goes somewhere has to reverse and then keep going yeah I I think I think Williams overall just needs a lot of help yeah, they, they need a couple of miracles, but I think from a, from specifically from a Logan standpoint, I do think that he is driving just about on par with how he was driving toward the end of last year. Right. Um, so I, I, so I just, you know, it's just, it's just every, everything that can go wrong for Williams is going very wrong. I know. And they were looking better towards the end of the season. So that makes me upset. But... Yeah. Also that, um, yeah, so it'll, it'll, it'll be, be interesting, interesting to see what happens with those chassis. I think yeah. moral of the story for them is they need three next season from the jump. And from I mean, the they, they 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 did they made a very they made a lot of of technical changes, management changes, everything changes at Williams um, over over the winter break, which is not long and getting shorter every year. So yeah. you know. And and Williams, as as we have said, is is typically a a team that improves as the season goes on. And we are only in race four, even though it feels like we've been racing since February when Lewis announced that he was leaving Mercedes. Yeah, we got we're only one sixth through the uh, season. That's wild. wild. 